At the second international mistletoe meeting at Helixor in Rosenfeld, mistletoe experts from all over the world came together to discuss the growing importance of mistletoe therapy in their countries. See, mistletoe in Germany is uh, an established science. It is coming up in a big way in India. It is uh, a revolution in the making, as I, as I already said. It is a revolution in, in the making in India and as well as in Asia. We use Helixor about 15 years, uh, but I, I am use Helixor preparations about five years. Um, uh, we consider Helixor as uh, exclusive preparation in precancerous diseases and uh, we consider this direction uh, as very perspective for many, many uh, cases, for many problems. Top-class mistletoe experts and doctors shared their knowledge and experience with the professional audience. PD Harald Mattes, head physician at Hospital Habelhöhe, talked about the intratumoral application of mistletoe in cancer therapy, a new successful application approach to treat intestinal tumors. Just one of the many interesting speeches the around 120 international congress participants could benefit from. I think the awareness here is much more just from what I see from the, the doctor speaking here and I often use Germany as an example when I explain to patients. I say, you know, your oncologist here might not know what it is, but you know, in Germany, you know, 60% of patients there use it and their their oncologists are aware. So I use that as more of a an example. I think it's been used here longer. I think it's getting more and more popular in Canada just because more of us are using it there, but I still think it's uh, kind of a gray area. But it's, it's getting better with more research that we have. Natural drugs made from mistletoe and hellebore used in cancer treatment. The importance of mistletoe therapy as a part of integrative oncology is rising. I believe that uh, we are in the moment of opportunity because at the same time the Ministry of Health it's opening the door to research in integrative medicine. Then we have the opportunity in the universities and the public health to do uh, experiences with, based on evidence with uh, mistletoe. For other hand, the oncological society don't know almost nothing about mistletoe. It's unknown because they uh, conduct more the the schedule from the United States and not for so many from Europe and, and seems that in this moment we can start to include the mistletoe as an integrative protocol in oncology. Mistletoe products today are amongst the most widely used complementary oncological treatments. Interest in this form of therapy is growing on an international level. For the second time already, mistletoe experts and doctors from all over the world joined Helix's international mistletoe meeting in Rosenfeld. In the spotlight, the mistletoe, an extraordinary plant with astonishing effects used mainly in the field of integrative oncology. Mistletoe is probably the most important therapy that we use uh, because it can affect so many aspects of a patient care. Um, whether it's uh, improving quality of life, reducing side effects of conventional treatment, or um, potential for improved survival and prevention for recurrence. There's a lot of really a, a great role that mistletoe has. So it's probably the core um, element of integrative oncology practice. There's a worldwide growing interest in mistletoe therapy. At the Congress, many of its different applications were discussed by various experts. So I've been using mistletoe therapy in my practice for about seven years. Um, really amped up the use of it over the last two or three years and I would say since my practice now is 100% oncology I'd say 80% of my patients use mistletoe therapies and so it's a huge player in their quality of life in having better outcomes with their regular chemotherapy or keeping them in remission. Alexa is specialized in the production of natural drugs made from mistletoe and hellebore, which are used in integrative cancer therapy. Mistletoe therapy today is one of the most widely used complementary oncological treatments. The quality of life is improved with uh, mistletoe, especially the well-being of the patient. It's uh, one of the number one therapies that I would use. Um, like I said, we do the basics. We include nutrition, we include counseling, uh, you know, and those types of things. But as far as herbals and or supplementation, uh, mistletoe is definitely high up there on the list. 
Top-class mistletoe experts presented the latest study results and shared their personal experiences in the field of mistletoe therapy with about 120 Congress participants from all over the world.